So you find your skin a little bit dry on the cheeks and you get a little tiny bit of shine. So you're, what are you using on your skin to tighten? Do you use a milk cleanser or a facial wash? Or a just a wash and get a Sometimes you need this as a And do you use a moisturizer in the morning and at night? Yes. Okay. And anything around the eye area? In the morning and in the evening. And the exfoliation, are you using an exfoliator? How often would you use that? Times a week. And a mask at all? Do you use a mask at home? Not too much, no. So it's quite often a product that gets forgotten. So we say with your mask, sometimes it's best to, if you can leave it on while you're doing something, if you don't have the time to relax and enjoy the product. Sometimes it's best to catch up, uh, catch up on some emails, maybe friend a friend, do something while you're actually doing that. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to uh, show you some products. So I would say this product is, uh, as we explained, really good for using the most sensitive skin. It's perfect for the eyes, uh, the face to cleanse, to shine, also to remove your eye makeup as well. The only thing this one won't remove is your waterproof eye makeup. And we do have one that will do that, so the eye makeup remover is suitable for all eye makeup. The eye, uh, eye cream, I would say, for the protection of the eye area, so we're going to try this one for you. And just see what you think. This one, I would use it, massage it on, and you'll see there's quite a lot for one pump, so just use this around the eye area. And then if you press it in, it will help the products, the acacia on the rhizobium, the gums, to kind of really sit nicely on the skin. So you can put your makeup on afterwards if you want to. This one will work on uh, firming, hydrating the eye area. It will work on anti uh, dark circles and also reducing any puffins as well. So I know you don't really have too much eye concerns. So this will help to prevent for any future aging. It will just keep that at bay. The moisturizer as well, I would say, if you want to try here. This one is... Um, really lovely it's quite balancing for the skin so this has uh, rose ingredients but also it has rice powder so it will control shine it won't feel too heavy but it will give comfort where you said you feel a little bit drier on the cheeks we have lots of rose which will soothe calm comfort the skin so it'll feel really nice even for most delicate skin so you will feel comfortable as well um so the micellar water is i'm just going to show you what happening so you would use in the morning or the evening, mm -hmm. ideal for traveling, I'm going to show you on this hand. And with this one, we would massage it on and you will see a foaming action. Mm -hmm. So this I would use to remove any makeup. And I'm going to use this one on the skin today to, to do a nice cleanse. So you see the foaming ingredients in there are gently cleansing. This is completely alcohol free, so it's very, very gentle and so gentle that you can, as I say, use it around the eye area too. Mm -hmm. And you don't need to wash yourself. You can use this in the morning. It's very quick and easy. That's really nice. That's really nice. I'm Do you use a separate night cream or are you using the same for day and night? We do a lovely night cream which I'll grab for you afterwards and also the exfoliation mask on we can show you too. Yes. I'm just going to prepare you for your cleanse and I'm just going to use a towel.